All right, everybody, start to shut up. Let's go ahead and wrap up your current sentences and get yourselves to a quiet place. Mr. Griffin, Dan is in my seat. Okay, I didn't even know it was his. You added me to this weird class and now I don't know what's going on. Calm down, calm down. Let's, let's don't be so rule-minded. No point in your adult lives will you ever have assigned seats, besides airplanes. And jury duty. If I've already undercut myself, don't add to it, okay? As you all know, this week we are devoting our attention to the psychological dismantling of my academic rival, Miles Leonard. Miles happens to be British. He also happens to be adopted. So, this week we will practice and perfect British accents. And whosoever is best will call him, posing as his biological birth mother, who he's never met, and tell him some sort of devastating secret. Any questions? Mr. Griffin, are you seriously never gonna teach us biology at all? Sure, Sarika. Maybe uh, Pablo Picasso can come in and teach driver's ed. Guys, I am a published Harvard philosophy professor. I have no interest whatsoever in teaching biology to you people, okay? So drop it. That's a pretty sweet deal on the table. Play ball, get an A. Come on, let's make this easy. I'm just, I'm just trying to cope through a year in Toledo with its miserable excuse for espresso. Put your hand down. Next words I hear out of you better be in a British accent. The bookstore at the mall has good espresso, my lord. Hey, not bad. Looks like Anthony's out to an early lead. Nice. Let's open it up. Yeah, remember, British, female, hurtful. Go. Aluminium, my favorite. Oh, I abandon you. Okay, what is his class?